Your music's too dang loud. I want to listen to it. I didn't even know you were recording. I told you I was gonna. Not at this time. What did you think? Hi. Hello. We're getting breakfast because apparently Chris is gonna die if he doesn't get breakfast. Oh, that is very true. Huh? Yes. Yes. I can't hear because he has two dang. You're gonna get my video flagged with your dang music. Why are you recording during said time of music? Said time of music. Because I want to document stuff, because I haven't documented like anything about our wedding stuff at all. You realize that? You're gonna crash into this car. That car is not gonna be crashing into me. <laughs> I don't crash into cars, cars crash into me. Oh, okay, that's how that works. Put your window up so I can hear it. We could eat at Hot Off the Grill, but it's expensive. They have breakfast, right? They do have breakfast. Do you want to get it off the grill? It's a good breakfast. I've never eaten breakfast there. I'm well, sure. We gotta go, because we have, we would have left earlier. I'm sorry, I took forever getting ready. Yeah, you did. I love you. I do too, I suppose. It's not like a restaurant restaurant. It's like a quick service restaurant, like at Disney. Today we're picking up our marriage license. Yeah. You're just too busy fixing oh, your yeah. dang Look at hair. my hair. My hair looks... It needs a comb over. <laughs> it needs a comb over. I don't I, I, I don't bring a comb. Well, good job. Anyway, so we're running errands today. We're gonna pick up our marriage license. If everything goes well, I hope. Because for some reason I feel like it's just not gonna be an easy thing to do. I don't know why, but I just feel like That's you it's one of those complicated everything. things. I do. And we're also paying off the last of our wedding venue. Um, but we have to drive like an hour away to do that. And we were also gonna try to get Chris new glasses, but he forgot his prescription paper because I broke his glasses like two weeks ago. Was it two weeks ago? Yeah, two weeks ago. Yeah. I broke his glasses, um, which makes me really sad because I like you with glasses. You look so cute with glasses. I can see just fine. Yeah, I'm sure you can. Oh, no, what's that? Get in the eye. What'd you do? You're such a jerk. There was nothing there. He's just a jerk. Jerk. I don't know why you marry me. I don't know. I, don't know. I question that every day. We're going to the, you know, healthy, McDonald's. extravagant McDonald's for breakfast. Well, where else did you want to go? You, you to just go said hot off the grill. You're going to crash in this car too. Yeah, but I'm hot off the grill is not <laughs> fast food because. Are we going through the drive thru? Well, yeah, why are we. Why? Going? It's 10 minutes away the place we're going to. Oh. What do you mean, oh? Then why don't we go hot off the grill? That's what I was saying. Do you want to go to a house, girl? Well, I guess if it's that close. I told you it was. This person's was looking like, at me like, what the f is wrong with what this the flip? Guy? Yeah. Yeah, because we were gonna get McDonald's and then we changed our mind. That's what. Never mind. We're going to hot off the grill. That was that was an adventure. Mm -hmm. Figuring out what to, what to get for breakfast. I told you it was ten minutes away. I don't remember. I know you don't. I'm sure you told me at a time where I just said, uh huh. Yep. Yeah. No, you're too hungry to think is what it is. Mm -hmm. Yep. Now we're going to the extravagant, fancy, hot off the grill. Dun, dun, dun. What are you gonna get? I don't know either. Bacon and eggs for $4.99. So I've never been here for breakfast before and apparently they have menus. That's weird to me. I've never seen a menu here and I've been coming here like my whole life. They do look kind of new. It's weird. I'm not used to it. That looks delicious. Look at those sausages, it's like perfect, but you got like so many of them. I want one. Are these suckers? Mm. But my burrito is like the size of a baby. Look at this. It's huge. I can Chris! Yeah, what's up? We almost dined and dashed. I would have gotten away with it too <laughs> if it wasn't for you meddling kids. <laughs> Literally, okay, this restaurant you usually pay before you get your food, but for some reason at breakfast, I've never been here for breakfast, you pay after. So I was like super confused and we like totally went to walk out. And they were even like, bye, thank you. And then I was like, wait, no, we didn't pay. So then we paid, because we're not terrible people. I have no idea what to expect. And that makes me nervous. So that wasn't it, apparently. Apparently there's two places with the same name because they were like, there's two of them. Oh, there it is, what the heck? We literally, okay, that was weird. Why do you want to get in the car? It's right there. Because then I have to walk all the way back. So what, you're lazy? Well, no, we gotta get there. Anyway, there was like people eating food. We have a minute left, so. Oh my gosh, run, run. 
We can't get married if we're a minute late. Well, if we're late, they might cancel our appointment. I hope not. Anyway, we have to walk down this shady alley, apparently. Chris wanted to get his car, because he's lazy. Okay, now we're here, and I don't know what to expect, but it's certainly not anything about what happened last time. <laughs> Hopefully. We got the thing. How do you feel? I mean, it's partly the step. It's not official yet. So. Well, duh, it's not official. We didn't just get married. You did Okay. Backtrack. Chris didn't even know that we needed a marriage license because he's silly and doesn't know things. More like I don't see the point. To prove that we're getting married That's and we're who we are. Like. Yes, and they need to sign the license to be the witness, silly. Meh. Meh. You don't know things. Anyway, we officially got a marriage license. That's the thing. Um, they made us raise our hands. This is my left hand, but they made us raise our right hand. That was weird. Why? So official. That's why. What? Why would that be weird? I've never done that before. Have you? No, but I mean, when you do like a swear of oath or something, they make you raise your right hand. I know, but like I've never done it before, so it was weird. That's all. That's all. Gosh, don't judge me. I judge you every day. I know. It looks really pretty. All right, we're here at the venue. We're gonna pay off the last of the stuff. Look how pretty the flowers are. I like how you always leave me, my love. You always leave me. Do you realize that we are getting married here in 63 days? No. Not that I'm counting. 63 days. I don't even think about the days. 63! That's crazy, right here. The trees look like they've gotten bigger too. How does that make you feel? Are you trying to imagine stuffs? Why are you looking at the bugs? Oh look, this is where we're gonna get married. Look at the bugs. Cute little bugs. They're not cute. Why? I don't that's know. Rude. You're like in a shadow and it's very awkward. There we go. That's a little bit better. What are you thinking? Hmm. You said 63 days. 63 days. Hmm. What does that mean? What does it mean? I don't know. It just all right. Huh? All right. All right. All Are you stressed now? Because I've been stressed for months. Yeah. It's your turn. I've always been stressed. I just show it differently. Yeah, I guess that's true. Dun, 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 dun. Do you want a picture? Oh, you want a picture of us? Oh, cool. I'm filming. You gotta look good. We need, a, we need a background. Okay, we'll go to buy a car thing circle or whatever. Anyway, uh, look at this spontaneous trip to Disneyland. With that, you get, you're you being a troublemaker. Get down. Spontaneous trip to Disneyland. Woo! Because we had time and we didn't want to go home and be lazy. And I'm not blocked out today. Woo! We've been wooing a lot. Have you noticed that? We've been saying woo a lot. Wee! Wee! Woo! That's Whoa. weird. Where do you want to go first? No, straight. Okay, we'll go straight. So descriptive. So descriptive. I can't talk. So I realized I don't have sunscreen, and it's really hot today. So I'm gonna burn really I bad. Go and see if they have sunscreen. We could go see if they have sunscreen, but then that's money that we don't, we should not spend. And also, I don't have a bag, so I don't want to carry sunscreen around in my pocket all day. Unless you want to carry it around in your pocket all day. Maybe. Maybe. Or do you want to see me burn? <laughs> Literally, that's all you do. I told him this earlier. All he does in my videos is like shrug and like be like, eh. That's all you do in videos. Yeah. It is pretty much what you do. Yeah. All, the, all the time. We're going to Paradise Pier. I don't know what we're doing, but that's where we're going. <laughs> <laughs> Every 
time. Uh, <laughs> ah, ah, I'm gonna die. Woo. Wait. Chris, why'd you break it? What'd you say? I broke it. It was me. It was like, hey, welcome back. I broke it. Chris, stop breaking things. We left and then that broke. We got on Zephyr and it broke. They don't like us. All our past attractions, all our past attractions don't like us. I don't know. That's really funny though. We're gonna go look and judge the Mania Fast Pass weirdness. Because I haven't seen it yet. How does Fast Pass at Mania make you feel? Indifferent, because I don't work there. <laughs> well, you should feel something for your pe the people you left behind. I don't know, he still works there aside from like Look at the, whoa, look at this, this is weird. Look at the new entrance. What the heck? Oh, and those are the thingies, by the way. Look at how weird. I'm judging it. So this is the fast pass view. It's really weird though. They don't even, the normal people don't go by Mr. Pinhead anymore. How weird. Yeah, we got, because we are totally re-riding. I just want it documented that I'm beating him for once in my life. Chris got the best in vehicle, and you gotta prove it. No, I didn't get a picture of my camera. Ah oh, man, you didn't prove it. Good job. I know you always win. Let's go on Buzz Lightyear, and then I'll win. Why are you saying no? Because it's true. Look at this gorgeous Sunday we just got. All right, now you can eat it, my love. He always gets so mad at me because I make him wait so I could take pictures of it. What? You don't need to do that. Yes, I do. I do. Is it good? Let's get a real scoop. A real one, because the last one was fake. It's very small. Now how's that? Good? You approve? I didn't get the strawberry stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> You're gonna eat the whole thing before I even get a bite. Oh my god. My spoon fell. Spoon fell. These misters are new.
me as a cow. That's fun. That's a cow dancing on my cat. <laughs> and I took a face of the cow. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice that. That's so funny. Um, and then various different, and then the cow dancing on the bush. You're so entertained by this cow. He's cute. He is cute. She. She. Cows are female. Whatever, she didn't have udders though. Uh, did she? No. Okay, oh, you're, oh, you're right. <laughs> Stand corrected then. <laughs> well then. That is weird. Why doesn't she have udders? I don't know. I didn't even notice that. That makes me a little upset. Why? Because a cow without udders is not a cow. Here. That's cool. We all want to do something. Is that you dancing? Sort of. And covering your face. Great. It is. She gets some sunglasses. Or, you know, regular glasses. Maybe you can see better if you just do this. What color do you want? What color do you want? Looking at it. Alright, I'll let you go. Let me guess. It's gonna be blue. No? It's not blue? Really? It's totally blue. Okay. Go. Go, go, go. The dark blue one with a mustache. No, it's not. The girls don't. Only the guys do. Yeah. I just proved you wrong. Whatever. your face. Buckle the belt. Buckle it. Stuck with me. Yep, forever. Uh, yeah, we haven't married. I'm still stuck with you forever, it doesn't matter. This woman is here. Everybody dance. I am in Yeah. yeah. You gotta dance, Chris. Yeah. Not dancing. Dancing with these cars. Not a fan. Someone was bored. Look at this. I just found it like that. That's really funny. Someone was really bored. Do you want to draw something? No, why not? Rude. Alright, so I drew this flower thing and then I drew Mickey. And you're still working on yours. I'm just darkening the lines. Oh, okay. Now. I'm putting mine in the mirror one. There we go. All right. I just have a flower, and it's growing. Look at my growing flower. Chris, do you see? Look at it. I'm gonna spin it faster. Yeah, it's growing. 
Yeah, you see the mirror when you can see it better. Ready? Set, go. Wait, which way? We'll figure it out. All right. Not that way. The other way. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. No, that actually looks really good. When it crashes. I wish there was more crashing happening. Yeah, no, there could have been two more frames of the crashing. impact and then exit. But it looks one good. One for the impact, one for the exit. Yeah. Good job, Chris. You worked on it for like a hundred years. Wow. <laughs> We're messing it up. There we go. All right. Do you want to keep it or do you want to recycle it? Are you ready to go to the jungle? Oh, I guess we're already in the jungle. We're not leaving the jungle, we're in the jungle. I'm tired. I'm hot. It's hot though, it's really humid. It's also really bright still. It is very bright. Wait. What? That's why my eyes are like squinting. It's like, ee, I can't see. Oh, I wonder if they still have the golden churros. Have you heard about the golden churros? No. They're golden. They have flakes of gold on them. They do. But it was only a limited time, so I don't know if they still do or not. Oh, there's a churro stand right there. I see. Looks like they're only normal churros. Yeah. That makes me sad. I would have tried the golden churro. It apparently tasted like Fruit Loops. Fruit Loops? Yep. So we're gonna go on Thunder Mountain. And then we're gonna go get food. And then I think we're gonna leave. Because we're boring and old. Yeah? Yes, what? I said we're boring and old. <laughs> I am, I'm younger than you. And what? And. and what? Hey, what's up, Goose? How you doing? Just chilling in the rivers of America? What did I say? I didn't say anything wrong. No, I was gonna go say hi to the seagull. Where you what did the seagull do to you? He wants to say hi. <laughs> Ducky! Quack, quack, quack. What's up? Are you hoping for food? We don't got food. No, we have nothing. Yeah. Sorry. It's like, then I'm out of here. Bye. Let's go mad. What are you saying? Let's go eat. Uh oh. I don't know. I speak English. Well, I guess, um, you know, the theme of today is us breaking rides. Thunder Mountain's closed. So Chris just wants to go eat. So I think Haunted Mansion was our last ride. That makes me sad. Yeah. What do you mean, yeah? Yeah. You don't care. You don't like Disney like I do. I'm hungry. I don't know what to care about right now until I get food in my belly. That's really annoying. You like need sleep and you need to eat or you're annoying as heck all the day, every day. Sometimes. All the time. But more so sometimes. No, more so all the time. Not every time. 
Yes. That would be all the time. So therefore, sometimes. So yeah. So I guess that was our spontaneous trip to Disneyland. Woo! Woo! Slash getting our marriage license and paying wedding stuff and errands and yeah. Now what do we eat? I don't know. We're debating. We don't know if we want pizza or Mexican food from uh, Naples or Tortilla Joe's from in downtown Disney. Tortilla Joe's. Tortilla. Tortilla. Is that how am I supposed to say it? I remember. Am I saying it right? He gets mad at me when I pronounce things wrong. <laughs> Tortilla. We've changed our plan like 500 times. I want him to see the Tangled show at the Royal Theater and it starts in a half an hour. So I convinced him to not eat for a half an hour, which is a big feat. Please welcome Mr. Spice and Mr. Jones. Spice, and I'm Mr. Jobs, and how is each and everybody doing today? Welcome to the theater, the famous royal theater, and while we're in the theater, I say let's do a play using our imagination as well as good enunciation. Together we will be creating a creation that will take your breath away. Shall we play as play today? Ah, today we shall render upon these boards an adventure that is most hair-raising. Ah, uh, well said, Mr. Smythe. But today we tell the timeless tale of Tangled! It's a very special tale of a very special girl. She's full of hopes and dreams, a little something like you. And if she puts some work into it, takes her mind up to pursue it, she can make her wish come true. It might be only hard to do, but with the invitation to join us in a live performance of your story. Well, it's my pleasure. After all, who better to help us tell the story of Rapunzel than Rapunzel? This is going to be such an adventure. Now, the tower wouldn't know she wondered. When would her life begin? My dream was to see the floating lanterns that appeared in the night sky every year on my birthday. But today, like every other day, Rapunzel's daydreams were interrupted by the sound of a familiar voice. Rapunzel! Let down your hair! Oh, let me undo that Wait a minute, wait a minute. You have no idea how long it takes to break this. Mother Gothel was not Rapunzel's real mother! That's right. I was kidnapped by Mother Gothel when I was just a baby. And why was Rapunzel kidnapped? Oh, Mr. Jones! Because of her magic hair, yes! Which keeps Mother Gothel the fairest of them all! Absolutely not, Rapunzel! Oh, sorry. Samuel. Flower gleaming gold, let your power shine. I told you, my dear. The world is a dangerous place filled with ruffians and thugs. Rapunzel spotted a young man climbing the tower. Oh, a stranger! And as the young man hauled himself up into her tower room, the ladies a hearty huzzah for Flynn Rider! Imprisoned 18 year old girl who just knocked down a climbing stranger would do. <laughs> After that, she went through his belongings, found a royal crown, and hid it. Now, surely I can convince him to take me to see the floating lantern. What? I had a dream. Once, 
I knew you would like it. Uh, we also met Flynn and Rapunzel after the show. I'll show you the picture. It was really cute. Um, yeah, there's, oh, you can't see anything. There it is. It's super cute. And then food. So do we decide on Mexican or pizza, my love? Probably Mexican. Mexican? Mexican. I forgot to film the Mexican food. Chris is like done. What? We were hungry. You were hungry. You were thirsty. I was thirsty. I got like really dizzy. Like right before we sat down. And I'm pretty sure I'm dehydrated. So that was fun. So I'm probably not gonna finish this. It's delicious. But I can't finish it. But you feel better, I'm sure. Look at you. You're so happy with your food. Now you're gonna want to take a nap. That's the curse of living. Well, I don't even live with you. That's the curse of being you. Yes, yeah. please. That's the curse of being with you. Is that you're grumpy if you eat. If you don't eat, you're grumpy if you don't sleep. And then after you eat, you want to sleep. And it's just like this cycle of stuff. The Chris happy cycle. The Chris happy cycle. I'm super oblivious and didn't even notice that they completely tore down the House of Blues. I knew that they were moving it, but I didn't know they were tearing down the building. So yeah. Chris noticed apparently, because he's smarter than me. What was that hoo for? You sound like an owl. Woo, 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 woo. Um, so yeah, I feel a lot better, so that's good. Um, but Chris realized that they have built a Sprinkles Cupcakes here since he has last been here. And we all know he's obsessed with that. Gotta take it home for dessert. <laughs> I yeah, couldn't room. even I couldn't even eat dessert I if I wanted to. It right now. This is for later. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go to Sprinkles. Even though we shouldn't spend money, but you know. It may be my last Sprinkles cupcake ever. That's not true. In a long ever. In a long ever. Oh my god, they ah, They have the store here. Does that mean they have the tower dress? I hate my life. <laughs> money! I don't think you'd look good as a bellhop. Well, maybe you might. Your hair is very flat. It's a... There you go. How about me? This hat looks not even as good as the other one. You know. But like, I'm like literally dying because this is a thing that exists and I want it so bad. And it has, it has pockets. There's pockets. I want it. I don't know when I'd wear it. But I want it so bad. It makes me sad. Just look at how cute. It's so cute. And the purse. Look at the purse. Uh, it's like, why do they hate me? Look at the little, the little button. You're judging me. It's so cute. Stop touching her boobs, Chris. Stop it. Boobs are hard. But the. There's pockets. I hate my life. I like how you automatically turned off your volume. Or down your volume. I appreciate that. Did you have a good day, my love? Yeah? Are you sleepy? You had fun? It's a good spontaneous trip to Disneyland? Disneyland. Disneyland? Disney, Disney World? Disneyland. Disneyland? Disney World? Disney World? I don't know, we're delirious. I apologize for that. That was awkward. No, that's just how I say it. No, it's not. No, you don't say it all the time? Like no, that? 90% of the time. Mm, not all the time. Because you're joking, though. No, I'm for real. Do I really? I don't know. I don't know half the stuff you do. Hey, look, my battery's dying. That was like perfect timing. Do you have any last words, my love? sums up my feelings in general way. I love you. I love you too. But okay, bye for realsies. Ciao. Ciao. Uh, I don't say ciao. That was a Bon voyage. Adios. Amigos. Aloha. What else? Arrivederci. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Okay, bye.